Welcome back to another video from Matt Gourmet Kitchen. Today I'll be showing you guys how to make some delicious Dragon Stout ice cream. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe and also click that notification bell to get notified when I upload all my contents. All that I'll be using to make this Dragon Stout ice cream will be listed down in the description box so you guys can ask out here and get the full ingredients. Javi Beats exclusive. Now here's all my ingredients that I'll be using to make my delicious dragon stout ice cream. You will need some vanilla essence, a tin of evaporated milk, you're gonna need a tin of condensed milk, you're gonna need some double cream, a bottle of dragon, also you're gonna need some powdered nutmeg, and also you're gonna need some salt. All the measurements for my ingredients will be listed down in the description box. Now you wanna go ahead and get yourself your basin. We're gonna be mixing up your double cream in. I'll be using two cups of double cream. Yes, guys. So, if you don't have a mixer guys, you can always go ahead and use your hand whisk. But it's best to use a cake mixer guys, it's much more easier. It's up to you, if you don't have any, you can use your hand whisk guys. Now I'm just gonna whisk this till I get a stiff consistency. Now look at that guys, you can see it's getting there. It's gonna take a little while to get that stiff consistency that I'm looking for. Let's get in there, guys. This is how you want your double cream to get to be looking at this moment. Guys, I'm just gonna continue to mix this some more and I get right back to you. Now, this is what I'm talking about, guys. Look at that getting creamy and nice guys now, that is how I want my double cream to look and this is how your double cream is supposed to be guys when you're making this delicious dragon stout ice cream right, guys all stiff and creamy yes guys now I'm just gonna put this to the side over here and start on my wet ingredients now I'm using my glass measurement jug to mix all my wet ingredients in. You can use whatever you have at home to mix up these wet ingredients. Then I'm going in one bottle of Dragon. Yes guys, you want to make sure these wet ingredients, they are all cold. Especially your condensed milk, your evaporated milk. Yes guys, you want to make sure you put them on the fridge to cool. This is how you want to make that Dragon stout ice cream. Condensed milk. Guys, one tin of condensed milk I'll be using. Also, I'm going in with my salt, guys. This is what's going to bring up that lovely flavor in your dragon stout ice cream. And also, the salt prevents the ice cream from hurting your belly if you're allergic to milk. Not neck too. And also I'm going in with my vanilla essence. I'm using two teaspoons. Like that, guys. Now I'm just gonna mix this up before I add it to my double cream. Guys, I wanna make sure you mix it up, mix out that condensed milk properly. That's down in the bottom there. Finish mixing this around guys, I'll get right back to you. Now here we have it guys. I'll mix out all of that dragon condensed milk and that evaporated milk, especially with that nutmeg and salt. Yes guys. Like that now. Now it's time to add it to my double cream that I was just mixing. Tell me guys, dragon stout ice cream. 
it's so amazing guys. This is one of the ice cream that I grew up on. I live in Jamaica. Going to Devon House. Yes guys, I'm telling you. This is a must have ice cream when you go to Devon House. It's and rum and raisin, but Dragon Stout. It's a must try guys. It's a must have anytime you go to Jamaica on holiday and you go to Devon House. You got to try this one out guys. But here I'm sharing the ingredients with you. So if you can't make it to Jamaica, you can make it at home for yourself guys. And enjoy it with you and the family. Yes guys. Now I'm just gonna add this gradually and mix it. You don't wanna add all in one, just add it gradually. So that guys. Now I'm just gonna give this a mix. Now here you have it guys, after you mix up all of that that ingredients, that dragon, that condensed milk, the evaporated milk, especially your vanilla, your nutmeg and your salt. Yes guys, that's how you want it to look when you mix it up into your double cream. Look at that guys. Wow, it's looking beautiful guys. Looking really amazing. Can't wait to put this on the fridge guys. I'm gonna have some of this and stout ice cream now you want to go ahead and get yourself a container where you'll be storing it in you want to get a container with a cover so guys if you don't have one in a cover you can always use a foil paper or a piece of baking paper and put over it yes, guys now i'm just going to add this to my container now you want to store this on the fridge for about 78 hours. Just guys, I'm just gonna add the rest into my to our next container. Even if you have a container like this, guys, it's also good to store your ice cream in. Wow, well, that's it, guys. This is so nice guys, I'm telling you. Now I'm just gonna put these on the fridge and I'll get back to you guys. Now here is my Dragon Stout ice cream after that eight hours in the freezer, yes guys. Now I'm just gonna serve out some of this ice cream into a bowl and I'll get right back to you guys. Now here you have it guys, I've served out my Dragon Stout ice cream, also I've garnished it with some sprinkles on the top, yes guys look at that. This is how you want to prepare this delicious Dragon Stout ice cream with all those lovely ingredients that I show you, yes guys. Thanks for watching my Bowman Kitchen, don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, hit me up in the comment section guys. Tell me what you think about this delicious Dragon Stout ice cream when you give it a try at home, yes guys. Until next time, thanks for watching.